What's up, Docs and Docettes? Trevor Thompson, the self-appointed Looney Tunes critic here, and it's the end of the day. Had a, we've worked all day, and now we, uh, we're sitting around here. What are we going to talk about? Let's talk about Looney Tunes. It is uh, is a new thing I'm doing here on the channel. It's called Riding the Shield. <laughs> That's right. Riding the Shield. It's your daily dose of What's Up, Dockery. And uh, today's episode is all about the Roadrunner and Coyote and Rod Scribner. Quite recently, um, or maybe not that recently, but a few months ago, I was very lucky uh, to be contacted by Ty Scribner, um, who is uh, Rod Scribner's uh, son. And he had seen a number of uh, my videos. So um, he, he reached out to me and uh, we, uh, we arranged to have an interview, but uh, he, was, uh, he wasn't around for the, uh, the Warner's years. So um, uh, he said, you should really talk to uh, my older sister, who's 12 years my, uh, my senior. Uh, so I talked to both of them and uh, one of the only things that they both said uh, without any prompting from the other, presumably, uh, is uh, that, um, that that Scribner had discovered a coyote chasing a roadrunner. So here's two clips uh, from both of their interviews where this is discussed. My dad, uh, every morning, would get up early in the morning. He had an Austin Healy, and he would race all the Porsches on Forest Lawn Drive on the way to, to Warner Brothers. So <clears throat> one morning, he's goes down the driveways, going up the street. We lived in the foothills, so the chaparral and the mountains, there were no houses. It was just, you know, the road, our house, the road, and that's it. So <clears throat> he sees a coyote chasing a roadrunner. So he drives to Warner Brothers, and he tells Chuck Jones, he says, uh, I just saw something really interesting. I saw a uh, coyote chasing a roadrunner. Maybe we should do a car cartoon about it. Well, he he never got credit for it. He never got um, any anything, and uh, that's how it started. The feud with Chuck Jones, or the or why he hated no, Chuck. No, that yeah, that's part of the reason he hated Chuck Jones because Chuck ran with it. And, uh, and then he, my dad never got anything for it. My dad invented the Roadrunner. Do you remember when that happened? No, but I know my dad invented the Roadrunner because we used to have them in our yard up in Glendale and he loved the Roadrunner. Yeah. And he, he invented the Roadrunner and I think, I think Chuck Jones stole it. It's unknown whether Jones's distaste for Scribner started with this story specifically, but it certainly did die hard, as we hear in this story from Scribner's daughter, who began tutoring after she'd retired from teaching. And I had a student that lived by Chuck Jones. He lived right across the canyon from me here in Newport. It's a very nice area. And um, somebody said, oh, I, your dad's been an artist. Uh, well, I live right by Chuck Jones. And I said, oh, my dad worked there. And they asked him about my dad. And Chuck said, oh, what a horrible guy he was. And the student came back and told me. And I said, that was not very nice to say about my father. Sounds pretty compelling. Uh, what do you guys think? Uh, let me know in the comments what you guys think. Does it sound plausible? You know, what do you guys think? Tell me in the... Uh the, uh, in the comments, uh, be sure to give a thumbs up, like, and subscribe. Hit that stupid fucking bell for notifications anytime we do these. But I'll tell you, I'll notify you guys. I'll let you know right now. These little shows, Riding the Shield, they're going to be every weeknight, guys. Every weeknight, 5 o'clock Eastern Time, Riding the Shield from Monday through Friday. So, you're, as I say, your daily dose of What's Up Dockery. So that's going to do it for this installment. I'm Trevor Thompson, the self-appointed Looney Tunes critic, and uh, be sure to come by tomorrow for the next Riding the Shield.